So the last demo I want to show you is uh, the PBS Kids website. Uh, we'll play a specific game there. So PBS Kids, obviously, the American version of the BBC, or the BBC's American version of PBS, take your pick. Um, this is a, you know, a site that can be shared between children and, um, and, and parents. One of the really compelling scenarios here that we find from a company that creates content to enable, create software to enable content creators, is your PC and your phone are one-to-one -one devices, right? You have your phone, I have my laptop, and that's basically it. Kids get phones at younger and younger ages, but you know, they each get their own. There's still certain, um, there's still certain set of, you know, a colloquial American family that sits in the living room and watches TV together. One of the interesting things points at data, and you know, I was seeing some research presentation about this, is this expression of here but not here, or together but apart, which is families sit in the living room, but the kids have their laptops, the parents are working, but everyone has the TV going on together. So it's like kind of a unifying device that holds a lot of the living room scenario for an average American consumer household on a given night. And so one of the really interesting things that we see is how can the TV enable that for, from a gaming perspective? And you know, while we can all know that you know, Xbox, PlayStation, Wii enable this really kind of very innovative, high-powered, high-octane kind of gaming, not, maybe not the Wii so much, but you know, what can you do in the TV space to replicate this for all age groups, kids being particularly interesting? So I'm going to click over here into games. This is all Flash. You know, this website is built completely with Flash. And I'm going to load up this game called Curious George and Mix and Pain. It's a really simple game that lets children um, learn how to mix colors together, how colors mix together to make paint. So while it's loading up here, here's Mix and Pain. I'm going to fire this guy off. And so you guys can kind of recognize that this is the Chrome browser experience. You know, I don't have a PC hooked up here. rollovers, all that sort of thing. And so, you know, this will go through, but, you know, there's, a very, there's some really interesting anecdotal information in the ecosystem from people who have done uh, user research, which shows that when kind of these gaming scenarios are available in the living room, parents, children will in interact together in these sort of scenarios, which is kind of cool. Um, so we see, you know, really cool ability for, maybe I need to click some more. Yeah, and so, you know, here I am, okay, I'm going to put Oh, and I was playing this earlier today, and I realized I don't know how colors mix together. <laughs> so if I want to make that blue, and add some white in, maybe one a little bit lighter color here. So I'm going to just fish as this. So, yeah. so you know, you, you get a sense, basically, of what enabling the full web on the television. You know, and full web on the television in a shared kind of community experience can really be like. And that's one of the really interesting and important things that, you know, we believe that Flash is a platform on Google TV and then TV-enabled devices is actually a really interesting place for us as a company and the, you know, the technology ecosystem as a whole to kind of evolve to.